Spanish 1, Personal and Public Identity, Vocab 51 through 55. The cheerleading. La animacion. La animacion. The cheerleading. The cheerleading. La animacion. La animacion. The cheerleading. 52. The activity. La actividad. La actividad. The activity. The activity. La actividad. La actividad. The activity. 53. Track and field. Atletismo. Atletismo. Track and field. Track and field. Ate atletismo. Atletismo. Track and field. 54. Bas the basketball. El basketball. El basketball. The basketball. The basketball. El basketball. El basketball. The basketball. And 55. The basketball. El baloncesto. El baloncesto. The basketball. The basketball. El baloncesto. El baloncesto. The basketball. 51. Cheerly. Animacion. Now, Annie's ma wants her to go into cheerleading. Or Annie may go into cheerleading. Also, if you've heard the word animated, the purpose of cheerleaders is they want to get the crowd animated, excited, fired up. So cheerleading is animacion. And notice it's feminine. Anytime, which makes sense because most cheerleaders, I guess, are female. But anytime a Spanish word ends in C-I-O-N, it's always female. La educación, la proclamación, la uh, emancipación, la discriminación. Okay? Now, activity. Now, here's the deal. If a word ends in O, like taco, it's el taco. If a word ends in A, like chimichanga, it's la chimichanga. But notice, activity doesn't end in an O or an A. So you have to memorize that activity is feminine. Now, remember I said any word that ends in C-I-O-N is feminine? Any word in Spanish that ends in D-A-D -D is also feminine. The truth, la verdad. The variety, la variedad. The activity, la actividad. The way I remembered it, but my dad is not female. But my dad is not female. So anytime a word ends in the letter C-I-O-N or D-A-D, it's always feminine. Now, track and field is atletismo. Um, <clears throat> a uh, son tells his uh, mom, I want to go into basketball. She says, no, it's too dangerous. I want to go into football or baseball or hockey. No, it's too dangerous. Finally, his dad says, look, at least let him go into track and field. It is mostly safe. So the dad says, at least let him go into track and field. It is mostly safe. Atletismo is track and field. Now, there are two words for basketball. You can say el basketball, or you can say el baloncesto. Either one is fine. But notice, this accent mark says, hey, stress this letter. Not the letter you normally stress, but stress this letter. So, basketball has an accent mark. Baloncesto um, doesn't have an accent mark. Either one is fine. And baloncesto actually means ball basket. We say basketball, they say ball basket. All right, let's see if you guys can remember some of these words if I cover up why is this so difficult there we go if I cover up the Spanish alright see how you can do